Lowry with 16 points, nine assists, and five rebounds. Setting up for three, bullseye! What a shot by Lowry! People seem to forget that the Miami Heat were just two wins away from winning it all just two years ago. Now fast track to 2021, they still have their main core in place in Hero, Robinson, Butler, and Bam, and they add PJ Tucker and the key of them all, veteran point guard Kyle Lowry. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you through another banging film breakdown why Kyle Lowry makes the Miami Heat a legit finals contending team. So without further ado, let's hop in the film room and see why Kyle Lowry makes the Heat a great team. First reason Kyle Lowry greatly improves this Jimmy Butler led Heat team is because of his terrific playmaking ability out of the pick and roll. Now everyone remembers the 2020 NBA Finals where Jimmy Butler went savage mode and turned into Jimmy Buckets. However, I think what most people remember was how damn gassed this dude was at the end of games. All of you watching remember the iconic photo of Jimmy leaning over the baseline gasping for air. Well, I don't blame him because he had to do virtually everything for that heat squad. Not only did he have to be their primary scorer, he had to set his teammates up for looks that only he could create. Now fast track to 2021, the Heat acquire Kyle Lowry because Spolstra and Pat Riley saw the exact same thing that I saw. A great Heat team without a true point guard to help close out games. Well guess what Heat fans, you got yourself a legit PG. The second reason Kyle makes the Heat a legitimate finals threat is because of his ability to find shooters, which of course we know the Heat have a boatload of. Whether it's Hero, Robinson, or Tucker running off a screen, you better believe Kyle is going to find them and deliver a perfect pocket pass. Now I want to turn your attention to the type of looks he gets his teammates. Kyle has a tremendous ability of penetrating the defense, collapsing weak side help, and then kicking to shooters. Why is this? so pivotal for the Heat you might ask? Well because the Heat have so many shooters on the court the spacing is plentiful for Kyle and Jimmy to get into the paint and then create many options for shooters. Next up, my favorite part of Kyle's game and arguably his most underrated asset is his defensive prowess. Now at barely 6 feet tall, Kyle isn't going to be wowing you with his tremendous blocks, but what he is going to do is steal a ton of possessions from the opposing team through his brilliant basketball IQ and tough Philly mindset. Here you see him putting his body on the line and taking charges from some of the largest dudes in the NBA. Kyle almost always leads the league in charges taken, and not only that, but he generates a ton of steals in crunch time. The fourth reason Kyle fits tremendously with this Heat squad is due to his ability to find his shots within the flow of the game. This is extremely critical to this specific Heat team due to their makeup. Because this team is very balanced in scoring with so many options, Kyle focuses on getting his scores in rhythm and taking what the defense gives him. Now this might sound super basic, but let's pretend for a second that Miami somehow acquired Dame instead of Kyle. While this sounds great on paper, guys like Hero, Robinson, and Tucker just wouldn't get the same looks in rhythm. This is what makes Kyle such a perfect fit. He gives you buckets without taking away of the flow of the game. Last but not least, the reason Kyle is a top tier point guard at the age of 35 is due to his ability to knock down the long ball at a consistent rate. Now of course, Kyle isn't going to shoot like Steph Curry, but if you don't step up, he's going to make you pay. Now we touched on Kyle's killer pick and roll skills, his ability to find shooters, and his ability to get to his spots, but the reason that he can do all of these things at a high level is because of his consistent jump shot. I always preach this because it's true, if you don't have a point guard who can shoot well, well, you don't have yourself a finals contending team. Well, good thing for Miami, they got big booty Kyle Lowry. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed this film breakdown on Kyle Lowry. Let me know in the comment section down below whether or not you think the Miami Heat have a legit shot at winning it all this year. Now, the Miami Heat, they haven't been healthy. They've been out with COVID. Bam has been out, but they still remain a fourth seed. And we've got some great stories in Hero having a massive, massive year. So me personally, I think this team is super underrated and when it comes 
playoff time with Jimmy Butler, Bam Adebayo, Kyle Lowry, Tyler Hero, PJ Tucker. That is a deep, deep squad. All right, so we'll see. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash the like button. Hit that subscribe if you haven't yet. I'll see you guys in the next one. My name is Wiseman. This has been Better Through Ball. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank you.